Hey there, this is Lou again, and it, I want to tell you guys that I'm so grateful for all the comments and feedback that I've gotten from the past two videos that I've did uh, in regards to my up and coming online electronic uh, technician troubleshooting uh, class where I'm going to be, te be teaching you guys how to understand electronics, how to understand your testing equipments, and then how to use those uh, knowledge of the electronics and testing equipment to troubleshoot and repair uh, any electronic printing cir circuit boards or electronic equipments. And I'm so excited, it's gonna be coming out in about a week. And I do thank you guys for it, for all the, the people that have uh, participated in it. I've got a lot of positive feedback, uh, spent a lot of time on Facebook chatting with people on uh, Messenger through these uh, private messages and I've gotten a lot of feedback saying that they can't wait for it to come out. So I do want to thank you guys for it. And again, this, this course is, is going to be taught by me. You know, I've got 16 years of experience uh, repairing uh, electronics down to the component level. Uh, of course, I own my own business and I have technicians that work for me and I also do it myself on a daily basis. So I'll be the one that will be teaching the course and I'll be sharing all the knowledge that I've gained over the uh, over the 16 years that I've been doing this. So I'm, I'll be teaching this course and I'm gonna hand over all the experience I have and I'm gonna put it onto this course and I'm gonna teach you guys how to do it. Also, be I'll be having a private Facebook group for all the people that join the group and uh, so that there will be support uh, on there. So as you guys know, electronics, there's there's so many different types of electronics out there in different industries from like the industrial to the medical to the computer to the uh, phone i mean there's there's tons and tons of electronics out there and the more people we, we could get in with different industries uh, the, the more experience we could uh, add into the group and that's one thing i'm looking forward to is trying to build that group and anybody that joins the course will be able to get in on that private uh, Facebook group so that we could grow as electronic technicians and grow as business owners if you guys do own uh, businesses and make some money. So that's the whole point of being electronic tech is to fix things and make money, right? Whether you're working for someone or whether you have your own business and you're trying to fix things uh, for other people to make money. So uh, just like me, I mean, I own my own business and have like electronic technicians working for me making money for me. So that's that's what I do. Um, I'm not sure what you guys do, but uh, this is definitely the skill set that uh, I will be passing on to you guys. So watch as I take you through kind of the course, kind of the outline, and I'll walk you guys through that and g give you kind of a sneak peek into uh, the outline of the course and just to give you guys an idea on that. So follow along. All right, guys, so here is the website for the training. As you see, my logo here, Electronic Tech, and this is kind of the course outline. Uh, this will be where you could put your image on here, but here's basically the course. And uh, once you guys get into the course, there'll be an introduction uh, and then a little bit of information about me and the outline. Uh, what to expect as far as how to use this course to uh, nav navigate through what is expected of this course and then uh, week one basically this course what I found to be the best is if I walk you guys through it and, and most people are not uh, patient enough and they like to jump jump around but you guys gotta get your foundation first in uh, so that you guys could understand each step as we go through and so basically each one of these is gonna be bro broken down into week. So like week one, uh, we're talking about having the right mindset, uh, n knowing how, to, how good or great electronic technicians, uh, wh what they think, what, what do they do, uh, just having the right mindset. So first thing we need to do is have the right mindset. Uh, and then uh, still on week one, we do like, we talk about like safety, personal safety. How do you keep you safe, right? You don't want to power something up and and you know 
shore something up and something would blow up and um, cause a fire or you don't have on any safety glasses and something blows up and it gets in your eye right we want to talk about personal safety uh, how to uh, use proper safety uh, techniques uh, for you and then uh, proper safety techniques for your boards uh, electronic equipment so we'll be talking about safety part of it and then we'll talk about Ohm's law mainly I want to dive into the voltage current and resistance that's kind of foundation of, of electronics you have to understand those things first so that would be on week one and then week two we'll move into uh, testing equipment these are we could talk about testing equipments like forever but I know not everyone is built to have a lot of expensive uh, testing equipment like for me I've got one here that is like eighty thousand dollars um, for um, as a testing equipment there's no way you guys can go out there and buy that so uh, what I've limited to is some of your most common uh, testing equipment so week two we'll talk about like power supplies your AC DC power supplies and then digital multimeters uh, ESR meter signal generators uh, oscilloscope uh, curve tracer All right so week two would be that week three would be uh, again, oscilloscope, uh, curve tracer, uh, teaching you guys how to use it, when to use it, uh, basically what it's used for, uh, how can you use it to test your electronics, electronics components. And then week four, we'll go into components. So we'll talk about fuses. Uh, why are fuses important? Well, if you, if you replace, if a fuse is open up or blown up, uh, what do you replace it with, right? Why why does the amperage matter? Why does the voltage matter? Why does a fast acting or or super fast acting fuse uh, or slow blow? Uh, what is the difference? Why right? Uh, so those are things that we'll have to talk about because as electronic tech, you you don't want to just replace any fuse with something else. Uh, you're gonna damage uh, the circuitry or you're gonna end up uh, hurting yourself. And then we're gonna talk about resistors, uh, capacitors. And then week five, we'll talk about diodes. We'll talk, and then bridge rectifiers and SCR thyristor. As you can see, it's starting from the easiest and then the foundation, and we're building up uh, to the more complicated uh, components. And then week six, we'll talk about triacs, LEDs, uh, transistors. Week seven, we'll talk about MOSFETs, uh, IGBTs. And then we'll talk about week eight. We'll talk about voltage regulators, uh, transformers. Uh, week nine, we'll talk about opto couplers. We we'll talk about uh, relays. is very important. Most of your boards, uh, if it has any any switching going on with a little bit more current, uh, you'll definitely need relays in there. So, how do you test relays in circuit? How does it work? Uh, what's the safe way of testing it? I mean, those things like that. So, and then. Week 10, we'll talk about integrated circuits. Uh, we'll focus on analog ICs, uh, digital ICs. Uh, week 11 is all about troubleshooting, putting everything together, uh, how to troubleshoot with no schematic, right, without schematic, and then how to troubleshoot with schematics. And then week 12, we'll, we'll talk, talk about um, just putting into practice, like how do you troubleshoot linear power supply? Uh, how do you troubleshoot switch mode power supply and then how do you troubleshoot unknown boards and then I'll have some bonuses um, thrown in here too so those are some of the things that I'm I'm still working on but we'll have some other bonuses on here on um, I'm not quite sure what all the bonuses are I'll surprise you guys with it but you guys would definitely love it but this is kind of the course uh, outline so so it's a 12, 12 week course it talks about all your fundamentals, all your electronics, and it will give you guys on the right step of understanding electronics, electronic components, how they work, how do you test it in circuit, out of circuit, how does it um, work in circuits, and what, what testing equipment do you use to uh, test the components with. So. Uh, we'll be touching all of these like even like I said the mindset the safety Ohm's law like what is current right amperage 
what is resistance, what is voltage, you know, AC voltage, DC voltage. We'll talk. We'll be talking about all those things and give you guys on the right foot to becoming an electronic tech. So, just a quick overview or, or brief view of the online course. All right, guys. Hopefully, you guys enjoy that little walkthrough on the the online course, uh, teaching you guys how to be an electronic technician, and it's basically again uh, just teaching you guys how to be electronic techs. So hopefully you guys enjoy that and you guys get it. That's just a sneak peek uh, in, into the course. And I'll, I'll probably be adding a few more things on it because I got a week before I launch it. So just trying to make it as nice and complete as possible. But that that should be coming out maybe the early part of next week or the mid part of next week. And I'll be sending out emails uh, to you guys. And then I'll have a special uh, just for, for one week on, on the course but just uh, pay attention to that follow that and um, definitely this course will get you guys on the right track to learning how to understand electronics uh, understand testing equipments and then un understand how to troubleshoot electronics and the bonus is the facebook group you guys will be part of a group that would support one another i'll be on there my text will be on there and we'll be there to uh, support you guys so it's coming out next week and be looking out for it and uh, it, it it will probably be like a special for like a week and after that the price is probably going to go up because there's a lot of value in the course like i'm sharing everything i know uh, um, on there so i'm gonna probably just do it for one week i'm not 100 percent sure yet and then after a week the price is going to go up so uh, just follow along and keep up with us and just check your emails and you guys will be updated on what's going to be coming up so i appreciate you guys uh watching the video and the next video it will probably come out in a few days letting you guys know uh, what the offer is going to be so just stay tuned and looking forward to getting to know you guys and looking forward to uh, working with you guys and teaching you guys how to be an electronic technician so that you guys could be successful and make some money so again this is lou and i appreciate everything that you guys do and appreciate the support and thank you talk to you guys soon